There were 20 reported mass shootings last week, giving us a total of 247 on the year. On June 17th, Chicago had two separate mass shootings. Not necessarily common there, but not a surprise either. They've had 13 now this year. A total of 12 people were injured in the two. One was killed and three injured in Macon, Georgia. As it often happens, the man survived and the one female died. Two were killed and two injured in Richmond, California. The two teens survived, but the two adults, one male and one pregnant female, did not. This shooting happened outside a grocery store. Seven were injured in Philadelphia, five were female, when three guys opened fire into a crowd. All three were arrested. Fifteen were injured in Oakland, California, the largest mass shooting this week. It happened at a Juneteenth event. Four were killed and nine injured in Fortis, Arkansas, making this one the 12th mass murder this year. And again, of the four killed, three were female. Another that occurred at a grocery store, and 44-year-old Travis Eugene Posey was arrested for that one. Four were injured in our nation's capital, three females and one male, proving yet again that females are involved in these just as much as the males these days. One was killed and three injured in Meridian, Mississippi. Six were injured in Glen Allen, Virginia, all adults. One was killed and seven injured at the H2O Club in Louisville, Kentucky. One was killed and five injured in Canton, Mississippi at a popular hangout area where 19-year-old Jeremy Ollie Jr. opened fire into a crowd. Six were injured in Rochester, New York at the Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Memorial Park. Four males and two females. The shooting happened while a small group was hanging out after a jazz festival. Ten were injured, all male, two teens in Columbus, Ohio. The shooter was described as a male dressed in all black. Nine were injured, six males and three females in Montgomery, Alabama, three under the age of 18, when over 600 rounds were fired into a crowded party. One was killed and three injured at the Tampa, Florida Holiday Inn after a Jacksonville rapper celebrating his birthday was kicked out of an Airbnb. 26-year-old Charles Jones, a.k.a. Julio Fulio, was the one killed. One was killed and five injured in St. Louis, Missouri. This is the fourth one this year for St. Louis. Four were injured in Trenton, New Jersey. Two are in extremely critical condition. One was killed and three injured in Winston-Salem, North Carolina at the Mambo Castano Bar. And four were injured in Vallejo, California after a vehicle was set on fire. Stay safe, America. Keep your head on a swivel and remember, a bullet can travel over a mile unimpeded. So keep dodging those strays till these shooters get better aim.